what up? Welcome to Mel Boxing No Problem. I am Mr. Manage Jr. And today's video, we'll be going over everything to know about the upcoming fight between David Benavides versus David Lemieux. Without further ado, let's get into it. All right, let's begin with the fight poster. The first thing to note is the fight promoted by Samson Boxing with co-promotion by TGB Promotions. It will air on Showtime in the U.S. on Saturday, May 21st. David Benavides will make his return to the ring after a six-month layoff not having fought since November 13, 2021, in a fight he won by seven-round TKO against a game Kyron Davis. David Lemieux will make his return to the ring after an 11-month layoff. His last fight was versus David Segarra, which ended in a second-round TKO. The fight will be contested at the super middleweight limit of 168 pounds and is scheduled for 12 rounds. The contest will also be for the WBC interim 168-pound title, making the winner closer to being next in line for the full version being held by Canelo Alvarez. The main undercard fights for the event start at 7 p.m. Pacific, 10 p.m. Eastern. You can expect Benavides and Lemieux to make their ring walks around 9 p.m. Pacific, 12 a.m. EST. As for the fight location, that'll be at the Gila River Arena in Glendale, Arizona, making the Phoenix native Benavides the home fighter. Next, we'll switch over to the tell of the tape. Let's start off to with the overall records to see how the fighters stack up. David Lemieux has had 47 bouts with, with the record of 43 wins, 4 losses, no draws, and 36 knockouts. David Benavides has had 25 bouts with the record of 25 wins, no losses, no draws, and 22 KOs. As far as the power department, Benavides has the edge in power. 88% KO ratio for Benavides compared to Lemieux's 77% KO ratio. Next, we'll go over the physical attributes with Benavides having the edge in height by five inches and also enjoying a five inch reach advantage over Lemieux. As for fighting stance, both fighters fight out of the orthodox stance. With regards to their age, Lemieux is 33 years old while Benavides is 25 years old. Lemieux made his debut back in 2007 and has racked up 197 pro rounds while Benavides debuted back in 2013 and has accumulated 115 pro rounds. For having 82 more pro rounds overall than Benavidez, I'm giving the edge and experience to Lemieux. All right, let's go over now the rankings. Starting off with Box Rec, David Benavidez is ranked at number seven, while David Lemieux is ranked at number 12. Moving on to the ring ratings, Benavidez is ranked at number one, while Lemieux is ranked at number six. And to finish off the organizational rankings, David Benavidez is ranked by two of the four organizational bodies. He is ranked number two WBO and number one WBC. David Lemieux is also ranked by two of the four organization bodies. He is number three WBO and number two WBC. Now moving on to the betting odds, which is being brought to you by our sponsor, BetUS. I'll leave a link for them in the description of the video in case you'd like to use them to place your bets for this fight and also take advantage of a sign-up bonus they're offering for my viewers. David Benavidez is a favorite at minus 1,999 meaning you have to bet $1,199 to make a $100 profit, while Lemieux is a plus 700 underdog, meaning for every $100 you bet, you make a $700 profit. Overall, Benavidez's chance of winning is 88.4%, while Lemieux has a 11.6% chance of winning. And we'll wrap up this video with my prediction, which has me predicting Dave Benavidez to win by KO. Benavidez likes to slug it out, and that means he's not really the hardest guy to hit, but he does have a decent chin on him. Lemieux is also an offense first, defense last type of fighter who has shown his suspect chin. I expect Benavidez versus Lemieux to produce a fan-friendly fight for however long the fight lasts. Lemieux does have a puncher's chance, but to land a punch, he will have to overcome Benavidez's significant height and reach advantage and eat some punches trying to get inside. Eventually, Benavidez will land a powerful punch too many on Lemieux to end the fight and keep him in the running to face all the big names at 168 pounds. And, and there you have it. You now know everything you should know about the clean fight between David and Vides versus David Lemieux. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, drop a like and also please subscribe to the YouTube channel. Until next time, remember, mo boxing is no problem. Peace.